New big game meta and on sale. PewDiePie Legend of the Bro Fist. I can see the link, dude. I can see the link. I'm not playing PewDiePie Legend of Bro Fist. I don't even know how long I'll be live because I have to go to Tommy and its show today. My friend Tommy and is doing a live show. I don't even know what it entails. I heard George not found and Wilbur will be executed on stage during the show. I don't think it's gonna happen. I'm literally booting up Minecraft. I don't even know if there's any even servers on here. I don't even know what any of these servers are. The Tunisian Connor Eats Pants community is here to support you against the Hamas allegations. What Hamas allegations? What are you talking about? There's Hamas alleg- I'm not affiliated with Hamas. I'm not playing this. This sucks. We feeling Mario Kart today, fellas? What do we think? It's about the only game I feel like playing lately. Did you see the goofy Kanye and Kai Sinat drama? You hate to see two goats duke it out like that, bro. Why can't they all just love? I heard that uh, XQC did not agree with my clip. Apparently. Someone DM'd me and was like, yo, they're cooking you on kick. So I hit up Felix and texted him and we hashed it out in the DMs. So no drama between me and XQC, guys. Have you seen the Destiny clip where he gets cucked in real time? Bro, which one? Destiny got cucked by JonTron. Dude, they should have had JonTron on that panel with like Norman Finkelstein in Destiny. Like JonTron should have been on the other side to get his chance back at Destiny for ruining his career. It's crazy that like back in like 2013, I hated Destiny for getting my favorite YouTuber canceled. And now I hate him because like, he's fucking weird. <laughs> Completely different reasons. It's like, why'd you have to expose JonTron for being racist, bro? Why'd you have to do that? I could have gone my whole life without knowing that. You know who wouldn't expose JonTron as a racist? Hassan. You saw the Kid Nation video from JonTron? Didn't I not? Didn't I actually like do Kid Nation first, if I remember? And then like the video just came out like months later. Yeah, I was the guy. I was the Kid R Kid Nation guy. We really need to bring that shit back. Kid Nation was awesome. And, and surprised Internet Historian didn't get canceled for collabing with JonTron. Dude, Internet Historian's always been weird, bro. If you follow Internet Historian on Twitter and you would ever, ever get like right wing like crazies on your timeline, you could click on the account and then see followed by Justin Wang and Internet Historian every time, guaranteed. But Justin Wang is cool. Yeah, I can't actually pinpoint where Justin Wang's ideology lies. I think he follows them more for entertainment, kind of like me. You seen the trailer for the Borderlands movie? Sadly. They're saying it might be the worst movie of all time. They put the Borderlands trailer before Zone of Interest? That's crazy. That's jarring. Like, there should be some movies that you just don't put trailers in front of. Like, what the fuck is that kind of tonal mismatch there? If the post credit scene for the Borderlands movie is teasing Handsome Jag, I'm gonna kill myself. Just kidding. How do you think the Fallout series is going to be? I thought the trailer looked fine. The only people that were mad seemed like hyper nerds. Like, actual geeks were mad, so it's probably a good sign. I want to try acting now that I live in LA, but I don't know how to do it. I feel like I'm a pretty good actor. You know who told me I'm a good actor last night was Valkyrie. I don't know what she meant by that, because we actually had this discussion. Valkyrie was like, yes, you would be. And I was like, what the fuck does that? All right, cool. True. I just got back from watching Kung Fu Panda 4 and it was peak. You must like enjoy slop because I've heard that that movie sucks ass. You, uh, you, you cannot convince me to watch a Kung Fu Panda movie that leaves out the original like side characters and replaces them all with a new Aquafina voiced character. Like you just, you can't, you can't. My opinions on movies come from the Connor Eats Pants letterbox. Dude, my letterbox is so viral. They always be posting my reviews on like these meme pages. What will Kai Sanat do once Taiwan is invaded by China and Ray gets drafted? Damn, dude, don't make me think about that. Imagine fighting on the front lines of Taiwan and Duke Dennis is up next to you rizzing. Rizzing the locals. You eat your like military rations and then Phantom comes up and goes, Phantom tax. Damn. What are these words? I can tell some of y'all aren't chill. That's okay. That's all right. Stick to your game explain videos, nerds. The rest of us will be having lots of sex and talking to girls often. Hey man, watching you on night shift at the esoteric white boy with a heart of gold factory. Yo, I've heard a lot of my viewers work there. That's mad chill. Shout out to you guys. I will have sex with Andre from Game Explain. That's a crazy message. <laughs> Alright. Dude, I can't wait for Andre from Game Explain to get the Switch 2 preview, bro. Can't wait to watch- Imagine watching that shit like a year from now. Suicide postponed. Hope I work for Boeing one day so I could fucking die. <laughs> Damn. I'm telling you that my conspiracy about Boeing is gonna be true, dude. That the airline industry is preparing for an actual disaster, and they're gonna blame it on woke. I'm telling you, they're gonna blame it on woke policies. And that's gonna be like the Republican angle to like, give them money and bullshit. Or to like, give them tax breaks. The woke mob crashed into the towers. Labeling the 
September 11th terrorist as woke is kind of awesome. They kind of were a bit woke, if you think about it. Does Osama fuck with LGBTQ? Yeah, heavy. Whoa, Markiplier in the lobby, holy shit. Dude, Markiplier remembered my name at a party like a few weeks ago, it was crazy. Jacksepticeye in the lobby, we got everybody in here, what the fuck? You can get along with anyone for better or for worse. Actually true, for better or worse. I'm a chill white boy with a heart of gold. What's crazy is that like we have a lobby full of these people and like it's not even a, a like community lobby. Like these people are just getting in here. They're just sniping it. We have XQC, Kanye, Iono. Name one person who wouldn't be best pals with Connor Eats Pants. Probably like terrorist. Even terrorists probably might fuck with me honestly. Kanye would fuck with you heavy. I wouldn't fuck with Kanye until he drops all that anti-Semitic shit. Cause I don't mess with that. We love the Jewish Connor Eats Pants community. Yo, Squid Game! What the fuck? Stacked lobby! Holy shit! Did I realize that, like... <laughs> I made this through this- I've been thinking so much about life lately, just cause, like, everybody I know from, like, high school is, like, getting older, that, like, went to my, like, Christian school. And I started to realize I'm not getting invited to, like, the weddings. And I was like, you know, maybe, like, my language and, like, the way I've behaved in, like, my streams is, like, throwing them off. Maybe they don't like the direction I've taken my life. Yo, Mr. Beast in the lobby. All right, I'll let Mr. Beast win one. Feeling like Chandler right now, you know? Second to Mr. Beast, second in line. <laughs> this Molly got me feeling like Chandler. Yo, for real, bro. Molly got me feeling like Chandler Beast. I was mansplaining Pokemon to girls last night, by the way. Emma and Cyan were talking about Let's Go Pikachu and how fun it is to shiny hunt on that. And I was like, actually, you should play Legends Arceus. Legends RC is just the best one. It has a slow intro, but then it's the best Pokemon game on the Switch. This is why you don't have kids. I don't want kids yet. I did have a dream like a couple of days ago that like I had a child. That, like I did, I wasn't sure it was mine. And I was like, well now I have to pay child support. That kind of sucks. One time I had a dream where I married my fiance and for some reason she had a daughter and we took care of her together. It was kind of cute. <laughs> Such a, it's really wholesome. <laughs> There's nothing weird. It's just like, oh, like I dreamed of having a beautiful life with my fiance and we had a beautiful daughter. Wow, crazy dream, bro. Holy shit. Dude, I was literally one win off getting gold in League of Legends last night and my support went one in 20. And I didn't even tell him to kill himself either. Like I, I held back. I didn't even say shit. I was like, it is what it is. When are you getting Meek Mill on the stream? Good question. I got to hit up his team. When's Lil B coming on stream? He kind of seems like he's backing out, to be honest with you. He's like, I don't know how to, like, do streams with other people. I'm like, it's okay, Lil B. I went to his stream a couple days ago, and his ass was literally playing Peppa Pig. I was like, this is awesome. He's a better variety streamer than me. Dude, I can't wait to smoke weed with Tommy in it tonight, bro. Imagine. Does Tommy get louder, or does he get quiet off the sativa? We gonna find out. He still feels like a child to me. Honestly, same. I remember when Tommy in it was just a little kid in my Discord server that was like, Can I talk to Connor Eats Pants? I have a video idea and my mods banned them and called him a loser. First time chatter named Fart Into The Microphone asked, Connor, can you please fart into the microphone? Welcome to the stream, bro. I'm not gonna fart into the microphone though, no. I think that's kind of gross. I have not found farts funny at all since I was like six years old. Maybe I'm different, but never made me laugh that much. Never cared. Connor, can you rethink your answer, please? No fart into the microphone. My answer is final. Oh, look who tapped into the voice chat, dude. Nintendo Switch Online voice chat. Did you like Vultures, Connor? I didn't even listen to it. I did hear a Kanye song on the radio yesterday, and I thought it was kind of ass, though. One of his new songs. Iono in the voice chat? I have to join. Iono? No, Iono left. It's all right. Iono? No, Iono's gone. Iono left. Oh, so you're not Iono. No. Okay, good. Making sure. Thank God Iono's not a boy. If I found out I was sending money to a boy for like 18 months, I'd be so sad. Did Tommy like made a group DM trying to like plan how we're all going to link up today for his show. And I replied with like a really stupid meme and nobody paid any attention to it. And now I feel like an idiot. I sent the fucking freaky ant meme where it's just like a really like hyper sharpened image. And it's like, what do you think he texts back? But it's just freaky ant. And it's a DM on Instagram from an account named Freaky Ant that says, I told the whole colony about you, bro. <laughs> Nobody cared. I thought it was a banger. You do a butt cam stream. No, I saw that clip though, that girl that like had like the green shorts on. And then she just superimposed the gameplay of Fortnite onto her ass. That was awesome. Someone had a funny tweet, got quote tweeted it and was like, women in STEM. <laughs>
You gotta be like a next level gooner to like watch that shit, bro. Like l level 11 gooner. Evil Konar, what the fuck? Who the hell is this guy? You need to get OnlyFans models on your stream so the virgin allegations go away. Why would that make the virgin allegations go away? Isn't that what Neon tried to do? Y'all wish you could be like Neon and have that kind of aura. Didn't he get banned from Kick? Is he perma banned? Is he done? You can like actively like picture the kind of kid that watches Neon. Like just the archetype of kid. Those are the kind of kids that should be making our iPhones. Not the talented young Chinese boys. I saw Nade shot last night, but I didn't say hi. I didn't get the chance. I wanted to ask him about his politics. <laughs> I had a lot of questions. He would ignore you for sure. I talked to Courage JD. I was like, yo, Courage, I still fuck. He showed me the Courage Reacts uh, gold YouTube plaque. I should have taken a photo next to it. I was like, Courage, we fuck with your family guy reacts every time you upload. Wait, it's Vamp Cardi now. It's not just Cardi, it's Vamp. Is he a vampire? Didn't Cardi scam Aiden Ross? Yeah, you hate to see that. It's just two goats going at it like that. It's just sad. Hate that kind of drama. Wish it was all love in this scene, but unfortunately it isn't sometimes. I felt like I was Aiden watching that stream, you know? Like, I, like you ever been in a situation with your fellas where a guy just, the vibe isn't there? I felt for Aiden there, bro. 30 minute upload from Asmin today titled Wokeness in Video Games. Maybe Asmin's just trying to make a play to like collab with Elon, in which case I respect it. Asmin called Wokeness in Video Games loaded. Wokeness in Video Games. This has been a very popular topic for the past couple of weeks, and let's be honest, it's been a popular topic for the last decade. And today, I want to talk about why it's a popular topic and what I think that can... All right, yep, I'm going offline. See you guys. Have a great evening.